Today we're in Durbanville at the Faircap Dairies Farm, where this popular dairy company will launch a new solar powered system to help them with their production as well as milking the cows. We, we want to make a difference, we want to do the right thing and this is what today is all about. And then even to our finance houses, uh, I don't think you were involved with this one, uh, but, but with, with with F and B and and Capital Harvest, we can discuss we can discuss the next project. Uh, but uh, thank you very much for sharing for sharing it with us and and being here. And as I mentioned, all our suppliers. Without you, we will not be uh, Fair Cape Dairies, and we will not have a company. And we really appreciate that. Um, as I mentioned, our motto is do the right thing. So today is all about going that in daytime that we in total will, what you see here happening, will be all on solar energy. A renewable energy, it's been something that's been, that I've personally been passionate about for many years. Uh, I remember long, long ago, not, uh, we had investigated in very big detail how we can utilize uh, uh, the waste cow manure, etc., from this facility in order to, to uh, uh, use that as a source of, of electricity for our business. However, we just from a financial point of view uh, could, never, could never make that calculations work and uh, with a deterioration of the state-owned enterprises uh, that even became more difficult because uh, to get them to take your hand in matters of this nature was fa fairly difficult or near impossible. However, for me I think it is important that before one um, shows or indicates certain things that happen that one just talk about this uh, necessity for the world to venture into this process called sustainability and renewable energy of which which the two are linked and the fact is as we stand here at the moment is that renewable energy and solar power in particular is actually the cheapest form of generation capacity that we have at the moment in South Africa. We're busy with about seven megawatts of projects around the country. Um, we have a pipeline of hundreds of companies that are interested in this technology. This installation is uh, selling energy to Faircap at cheaper than what they can buy it from ESCOM 4. If dairies start to do what we have done here and actively impact their uh, 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 their environmental uh, 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 exposure to the world that it certainly could have a positive impact on how consumers view dairies and dairy products and that could have a positive impact on everybody that is in this actively in this industry and all stakeholders. History was made today at the Fair Cap Dairies Farm here out in Durbanville when the company launched a new system, solar power energy will be used from today in help with production and to help with milking the cows. I'm Byron Lucas for City News, Durbanville.